Hey guys, I have a new app to show you. Its icon is on my watch face currently, that one with the green plus sign. It's Fat Finger Calculator. It's a calculator app, but you don't see any buttons or almost none of them, because in this calculator app, you can enter calculations by simply drawing on the screen. So here is two plus seven. I enter an equal sign and it shows me the result. And another thing to notice, how big the fonts are. Not needing space for the buttons, we have much more space for bigger, more readable text on the screen. And you can see it without reading glasses even. And we can go on with the calculations. See that plus sign at the bottom of the screen? I can add very quickly something, let's say six, just by using the plus sign there. And go on with the calculations like that. This button here will erase, or we can long press it to clear all. You can actually change that one tap action, the plus sign, by long pressing it and choose from any other arithmetic operators, the basic ones or even more advanced ones like sign change, one over x or root. And there is one useful option on the top here. You can assign voice search to that one tap action. So you can carry out arithmetics using the power of Google. What is three by 21? Three by 21 is 63. So this can be useful, but other times uh, you might want to assign something like a percentage calculation there. So for example, we can calculate what's five increased by 9%. That's your answer. What if you want to increase everything by 9%, like it's a VAT, a tax or something. You can actually pin that second part of the calculation and then enter any other number like 143 and notice now the bottom button changes into an equal sign when we have something pinned so we can just press that and come up with the increased value there let's do 66 and press equal sign there again and there we have a very powerful percentage calculator there you can also pin the first part of a calculation. Again, I long press here to clear all. And let's do something like 2.54 multiplied. And before entering the number that I want to multiply this by, I will pin this. And now I have a powerful conversion tool on my hands. So I can say what is eight inches in centimeters. There's my answer. What is 53 inches in centimeters? And I can quickly do these calculations. I'm going to clear this calculation now. Another pretty common application is when we add up lists of numbers. If we long press the bottom one tap action button and select this Sigma plus option, we are going to enter this sum calculation mode. We can start entering values. Let's say 12 plus 8.5 plus or 17 divided by 2. We can do that. What if I tell you that we can enter values even quicker? When I draw a digit on the screen, it takes a short while for it to register. It might feel like that we are waiting for the watch to decode the shape, but in reality, it's the opposite. The watch is waiting for us, whether we are going to input more strokes. For example, for a four, we can enter a second stroke to complete that number shape. Let me add this to the sum. Most of the numbers are drawn with a single stroke, a seven, a six. In fact, we can draw every digit with a single stroke, even a four or a five or an eight can be drawn with a single stroke. 
So we can enable a special option under settings, single stroke digits. Whenever we only enter digits, when the operator is pinned or in this sum calculation mode, the bottom symbol will turn green. And look how much quicker I can enter numbers. 21.2. Add. 28. Add. 5.7. Add. What if we make a mistake? The last item I added was by mistake, for example. I can use the backspace to edit that item or take it completely away and go with the previous one. You remember 28 was the previous one. If I take that away, it goes back to the 21.2. So it remembers the list. Moreover, we can press the trash can icon on the top of the screen to list the complete list of numbers that I entered in the session. And I can mark the ones I want to remove. When we go back, we are prompted to remove them. The sum will be, of course, updated. To clear all, we can long press the erase button and press the check mark. All of these are explained in the help system. There are some basic tips that will show you how to use the basic things, how to enter numbers and what different operators the app has, what the different side buttons do, how to assign different functions there. And we have advanced tutorials for the pinning system and also to improve your script recognition because everybody draws numbers differently. The app has a pretty robust model built into it. So you could see it could re recognize most of my numbers, but you can train it. You can add your own way of drawing numbers. So it will take you through all the digits and the different symbols that the app knows and you can give a sample. So some people draw a one like that and you can enter the way you uh, draw number two and so on. And if you want to give different models, you can go back and add yet another one. So you can personalize the recognition so it will work perfectly for you. If you make a mistake, a trash can lets you see all the different digit shapes and you can mark the ones that you don't want it to confuse with other numbers. So mark them like that and press the uh, trash can on the top and it will take those away from the model. So you can step through all the different digits. You can long press here at the end or just reach the end to save your model. It's also possible to retrain the whole system. So you can personalize it perfectly to the way you want it by choosing the retrain option. It will let you enter the numbers and then it will perfectly understand your handwriting, your doodles or script. In fact, if you choose to retrain the model exclusively using single stroke digits and symbols, the app will stop waiting for multiple strokes and you can enter complete calculations lightning fast. To prove my point, you've seen me retrain all the digits now and with some creativity, even the operators are possible with a single stroke. Multiplication can be drawn like a Greek gamma character. Division is easy. Addition will look a bit like an alpha. Minus sign is straightforward. For the equal sign, I will use a reverse L shape, resembling the symbol on the enter key. Finally, the decimal point. So these are the essential symbols. If I don't plan to use the rest of the operators, I can long press the right arrow to finish training. Notice the bottom one tap action button is green now, even before pinning anything. The app is in permanent single stroke mode for fast and furious calculations. 273 divided by 3 minus 6.8%. And if I want to calculate square root, even though I haven't trained it, I can long press the bottom to pick it from here. Going back to the settings, there's an experimental self-train option, which will learn over time as you 
enter different numbers. It will watch when you erase a misrecognized character and it will slowly shape and form the recognition algorithm to you. If you're happy with the way it recognizes your numbers, keep that self-training turned off because then it has already learned the way you like to draw numbers and symbols. So this is something very powerful and something very different that we have on this very powerful operating system called Wear OS. So if you like this, please share the video with others or recommend this application to others. And you're welcome to enjoy a new way to do calculations on your watch.